vacuum killer. Fine, I'll admit it. I kill vacuums with petrified hamburgers. So, what have you got here? Tons and tons of pillows. Pillows? <laughs> Why are we getting so many hundreds of pillows? Pillow pie! <laughs> <laughs> Hello, five. That would be pretty fun, actually, so maybe. I just had an image in my mind of Rhett and Link's favorite <laughs> pillow song. <laughs> yeah. That's an oldie. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. How many pillows did we get? We got ten pillows, actually. Ten? Yeah, we got to replace ten? old ones that we have for the boys. That's a lot. And use the rest for everybody that comes to visit all the and time. And I got some cool new shorts. They're like yeah. neon bright. All right, Confessions <laughs> of the Petrified Hamburger. Take one. <laughs> just kidding. I'm just telling Michael about how I was vacuuming out the van the other day and there's a 10 minute limit on how much time you could use the vacuums for and I was like trying to hurry as fast as I could and I like was shoving stuff in the vacuum <laughs> that I probably shouldn't have and uh, I put in a petrified hamburger one that was like rock solid just like the bun part of it but the vacuum stopped working and I was like oh 10 minutes must be up because I knew I was getting close so I went and asked I was like can I have the vacuum started up again or can I keep going because I'm not quite done and they're like sure did your vacuum turn off and I was like yeah I don't know why and they're like well it should be on yeah keep going and I was like okay so then I went back and I just used a different vacuum because that one wasn't working still and I was <laughs> you broke the vacuum with it, sucking up a hamburger <laughs> And then you pretended like it never happened, and you used a different. Deck. Well, I, I was like, I seriously thought there was a time limit. I, I was legitimate in what I was thinking, happened, but then I thought back to it. Okay, and here's went, the question. Okay, I Did probably you suck broke up the vacuum. A hamburger. I sucked up the hamburger bun. That was and really then crunchy. Did the vacuum stop working immediately after sucking up the hamburger? Not immediately. It took a minute. It starts like shaking and smoking. It's, like, <laughs> it's just like going crazy. It's like You're making me out. feel really bad. <laughs> you should feel bad. You were evil. You broke I didn't. four vacuums. It's just trying to suck up all your garbage. I did not break four and you vacuums. Destroyed it. <laughs> I'm a vacuum killer. Fine, I'll admit it. I kill vacuums with petrified hamburgers. Some guy after you left is like, why isn't this vacuum working? He's like pulling it apart and there's like a hamburger stuck in it. <laughs> a full size petrified hamburger. <laughs> That's like funny. It's I, just the it's kids like never eat a them. human head inside of the vacuum. <laughs> no, I, you know what, what it was? It wasn't a regular hamburger. It was that hamburger that was on that news article with the giant head in it, like the human head found in the hamburger. Sounds like the onion <laughs> Show us how comfortable those pillows are.
cold outside. It's raining. It's raining a lot. <laughs> it was like Michael sat out at, with my dad and was waiting in front of the pool for like a half an hour yeah. for us to finish getting all dressed and stuff. All the girls. <laughs> Takes that long. And it was so cold. I came out and all the kids had like blue lips and I was like, oh no, gotta get them in the car. They're gonna be freezing. They're gonna get sick. I hope they don't get sick. But they did so good swimming. James got, you know, that little mask, that goggle thing. And he was swimming so well. He was just jumping in. He, his head was underwater at least 50% of the time, I think. He was just practicing going under and holding his breath and going up and down and up and down and up and down and up. And he was getting really, really good at it. And that's a really big, important part of learning how yeah. to swim is just being comfortable going underwater and knowing how to hold your breath. So fun going underwater. Also, I made a friend. Also, he made a friend. <laughs> Ellie shocked and surprised me so much. Mm. Not only with her amazing non-camera shyness, she was being so, it was like she could turn it on every she's, time for the camera. She's a star. <laughs> she knows how the camera works. She sees herself and she sees that camera. And the thing is with the GoPro, you can't see the screen. Yeah, you can't and see yourself. And yet she knew she was on camera. Yep. And she was hamming it up for the camera. <laughs> She's a little star. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> she just kept jumping in over and over and she was actually jumping in the water where she couldn't touch the ground and she was moving her arms and kicking her feet and actually getting somewhere. She was moving in the water by herself. And then if she ever, if her face ever went underwater, she'd just come up and <laughs> spit it out of her mouth and keep going. I was so proud of her and then other people came and they were just oogling and ogling over her and oh it's so cute regular beach baby <laughs> i'm gonna tickle your face i'm tickling your face ellie i'm tickling your face corbin is completely out of it yeah. <laughs> his, his eyes are a little bit open it's kind of creepy <laughs> And Shinoi's back there, hanging out. And I will introduce you to my sandwich cutter. This is my <laughs> new It's basically yoga mat. a pizza cutter. I just and cut a sandwich. <laughs> That's Michael's new yoga mat. This is my new yoga mat. <laughs> he likes the tree on it. So we're probably going to head back and watch a movie. Yeah, Marshall and Molly showed up at the house. It was so funny because all of the children were in the front room just like playing and then like almost all of the adults were in the bedroom with us looking at old family videos and all of a sudden the door opens to our room and Marshall's face is like <laughs> with all of my kids and I'm like ah like I actually screamed a little bit I think it shocked me so much it took me a minute to register who it was that was in our doorway being creepy <laughs> and this was not our front door this was our bedroom door <laughs> <laughs> so I was like oh oh you're here you scared me I, I guess any there. stranger could have walked into our house and been playing with our kids or taking them and we wouldn't have known it. That's not good. Okay, let's be more careful. <laughs> okay, I'm buying a gun. All right, let's do it. Uh-oh. Brett. Fander bander. Um. Casey, please. Uh, <laughs> So what'd you guys think of my music video? Wasn't that pretty sweet? We sure do have a good time, don't we? Yeah, we do. I'm proud of my kids learning how to swim. They're doing really, really great. Thanks, you guys, so much for watching. Be sure to check out yesterday's video if you haven't seen it yet. It was a lot of fun. And also subscribe to our channel. That way you can join the Beach House and come back every single day for new videos. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. We will see you guys tomorrow.